Right Voice for You is a system and a set of techniques that allow you to be the voice you are in the world. It's like if you're a writer, you have a different way of looking at things. You know, it's like if you're a dancer, a dancer, you have a different way of looking at things. So it's like what this is designed to do is give you that place where you become the best you are and you can present who you are with ease. Wait a minute. I thought Right Voice for You was about everyone sounding just like me. No. That's not what this If is. If everyone sounded just like you, they'd all be gay. Gay Canadians who live in Australia. Yeah. Oh, so Right Voice for You isn't about that. It's about people having their it's own voice? It's not about becoming a gay Australian Canadian. No. It's I about having their own voice and how about being able to, quote unquote, pitch it in the world. Okay, I still want to be involved then. I know. Well, the mistake that I see so many people make with Right Voice for You is that they've decided that it is about singing and or it's about being on stage. And the interesting thing yeah. to me is having your voice in the world can take so many different shapes. Well, I mean, one of the things you did is you did you just did a a thing with people facilitators to show them how to create an announcement. I mean, it's amazing to watch people do announcements and they say too much and not enough and they have all these weird ass points of view about what they're supposed to be doing instead of doing what will work. Exactly. Like we have a voice in the world in so many different places, whether it's in your relationship, in a meeting or presentation, in a group of friends. Like imagine going to a farmer's market in the morning and someone selling strawberries and them selling milk and all of these different voices. And if you're willing to have that, If you're willing to have your voice, you can become irresistible to those yeah. around you. Well, one of the things I think it is, personally, from my point of view, it's about having to have your voice whenever you speak to anyone. If you are actually able to be you, whenever you speak to anybody, it creates a different reality in the world. And that creates a place where true communication begins. Yeah. Like, actually, it's amazing you say that because there was a lady who was talking to me yesterday and she was telling me about her stepmother. And she said, you know, I've never had a great relationship with her. And finally, I said to her, you know what? It doesn't work for me, you talking to me that way. And she was willing to speak up and go, here's a line. You're not going to cross that again. And the stepmother was so perplexed by it that it actually created a totally different reality for the girl and for the for their whole family. It's not just about singing, it's not no. just about being on stage, it's having your voice in the world. Yeah. And there is no right one, just yours. Yeah, and one of the things that occurred for me personally when I did one of my first classes here in Australia is Tim Botham was, was on it. Mm. I said, and he was going, well, I can't. I don't have anything to talk about. And it's like, and then he started to talk about what he knew about land management, and how to deal with you know, the world in a way in which it dealt with the best of what the earth has to give us without a point of view about what that looked like. I was stunned. I sat there with my mouth open watching him talk, and I go, and you don't think you have anything to say? You have one of the most brilliant things to say on the entire earth. What the hell would it take for you to get out there and do that? The, well, the thing that I wanted to say is, so if consciousness judges nothing and includes everything, but you're not willing to include you or include your voice in the world, yeah. what a disservice that is to everyone and everything. And to the world. I mean, yeah. it's like, that's the thing. That's the reason I created the process and created the stuff that we do in Right Voice. Because I look at it and I go, why does this person not get that they have a gift to share with the world? I mean, you'll share fucking stupid ass shit with people all the time, but you, you know, it's like you'll share your pain, your suffering, your no, jamming, no, no. the your Kardashians. The, we'll Kardashians. Share the Kardashians. Oh my God! Yes, but to actually share the voice you are, the gift you are, the possibility you are, is not done. It's like that's what has to change from my point of view. All right, so you got a song you can say? Yeah. 
Okay, good. Everything that makes you think you cannot be a great singer, everything you've been told about how you're not good enough, everything you've tried to buy about how you're not good enough, everything that makes you think that you aren't extraordinary in what you have to sing, and everything that makes you think you're not really greater than you possibly can perceive, where you revoke the camera, singer, play, and ask you to ask for the cradle. Yes. Right and wrong, good, bad, pot, and pock all night. Choice avoid me out. Okay, will you sing a song for me? First, I was afraid, I was petrified. Kept thinking I could never live without you by my side. But then I spent so many nights just thinking how you done me wrong. Then I grew strong. And I learned how to get along. And so you're back from my space. First I was afraid. I was petrified. I kept thinking I could never live without you by my side. But then I spent so many nights just thinking how you did me wrong. And I grew strong. I learned how to get along and so you're back from my space. I just walked in to find you here. Anybody see an improvement? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it feels a lot different. How's your body oh, still? <gasps> Wonderful. <laughs> well, it's like what occurred in the video is what I did is I saw the girl as who she was, number one. But number two, it's like this was a young girl who didn't know she had the ability to be something greater. And it's like I shared with, you know, it's like I shared her with the world by the changes I made. I made changes in her voice so that she could sing better, so she could be more present. And I asked her to include certain things, which I didn't tell anybody what it was. And I don't tell I never tell what it is, but I will tell you what to share with people so that you become more of a presence in the world. And she became a presence in the world. I mean, that's been viewed by 8 million people. 8 million people have seen that. It's like, that to me is the gift that all of us can be, where 8 million people want to know us, see us, and see what we do. The thing is, for most people who are afraid of speaking in public, you know, for most of them, 99% of the time, they're actually so thrilled and excited. You know, there's this joy that comes from being heard, with sharing you out there with, with an audience, well, with mean, everybody. The greatest example for me personally is when my mother was going to take me on a Ferris wheel when I was 10. And she goes, it's, don't be afraid, son. Don't be afraid. Well, it's like, I wasn't afraid. I was freaking excited. And it's like, and so I thought excitement was fear. And so for years, really fucked up my sex life for a while. And it's like, I thought that if you were excited, it was fear. And it's like, and it, it's not. And it's like, and the thing is, you really have to learn the difference between fear and excitement. And that's one of the things that we want to teach in Right Voice for you as well. Everybody, the right voice for Anybody you Anybody who's willing to be smart enough to realize they have something to say. Yeah. I did a right voice for you with a lady who couldn't sing at all. But the next week she went out and sold ten times what she'd ever sold before because of the voice she had in the world. Just because of that. Mm. What if you're a different space in the world? Would you invite more people to choose something greater? And that to me is the gift that Right Voice is. You talk too much, you worry me to death. You just talk too much, you even worry my pets. You just talk, talk, See, This is talk, Right Voice for you. He's talk to much the willingness to play the willingness to be heard the willingness to just go for it improvise play